And now it's my first sequel. But I'm Well, this is the first time I did a sequel because I actually filmed two episodes in one day. As you can tell, I'm wearing the same clothes as I wore last week because I was going home to see my friend Cody's wedding. <sighs> it's burning up in here. I've never uh, had the air conditioner off this long. I'm melting. Well, last week I talked a little bit about domain names that I wish I would have bought and didn't buy. And now for a domain name that I did buy and wish I hadn't. Yahoo.com. Notice there's 10 O's there. So I just bought this domain because I thought it would be funny for my email address to be Kevin at Yahoo.com. So whenever people are like, uh, what's your email address? It's Kevin at Yahoo.com. Yahoo.com. But it turns out that by owning this domain, I was infringing, apparently, on another website that will not be named copyrights, apparently. I think that it's totally ludicrous. I don't see why either of them would get mixed up, but they sent me a cease and desist letter and they were going to uh, take the domain from me. And I said, <laughs> No, I bought this fair and square. Give me my $12 that I paid for the domain. And they said, no, we are Yahoo. And we are big and famous and have more money and more lawyers than you. And so you are going to just give us the domain. And I said, on principle alone, I am not going to just hand over this domain. And Yahoo proceeded to contact GoDaddy and said, uh, hey GoDaddy, uh, I know we're best buds and everything. And so could you charge Kevin $50 on his credit card? Uh, yeah, <laughs> of course we can. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Uh, dinner tonight? Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. All right, bye. What? So uh, I look on my bank statement and there are $50 that have been removed, 50 of them. I called GoDaddy and was like, hey, what's going on here? You just took all the money that I have in the whole wide world that I've ever earned in my life. Apparently it was a processing fee for them to file a complaint against me for having a domain that they claim that they rightfully have. If they had the right to that domain name, you would think that they would have bought it but they didn't. They took it from me and I lost money on it. And that's why you and everyone else should delete their Yahoo email addresses because they're mean and they're bullies, and they're cyber bullies. And that is my story. I will see you guys later. Good night.